Hello, John Zimmerman from tabletclass.com here to help you out with solving equations. Okay, so those of you who might be um, in an Algebra 1, Algebra 2, Pre-Algebra, or another course um, might be facing something like this. Matter of fact, I'm sure you will be um, certainly facing an equation, maybe not exactly like this, but pretty close to it. So let's go ahead and just solve this one. We have a lot of other videos in this particular series. This is our fourth one, but um, anyways, I'm going to jump in, start doing this problem, and hopefully it will help you out. Okay, so the first thing you want to be doing when you're looking at an equation that involves parentheses, okay, you want to simplify that by using the distributive property. And notice I'm kind of rewriting each step. Now, this is the way you want to work. You want to work step by step by step. So I'm going to rewrite the equation, okay, 7x, but here I'm going to use the distributive property to multiply 3 by x and negative 1. So I'm going to get 3x minus 3 equals 2x plus 2 times 10 is 20 plus 5. Okay, so before I move on, kind of double checking myself, you say oh, everything seems to make sense. And now I'm going to look for opportunities to combine like terms. So here and here I have like terms. And let's see, on the right-hand side of the equation, I can just kind of like add these two numbers there. So um, if you're following along, maybe you want to pause the video and try it with me. So I'm going to get 10x minus 3 equals 2x plus 25. Okay. So now what I want to do is move all my variables to the left-hand side, or I can move all my numbers to the right-hand side. It doesn't make a difference. I'm going to focus on moving this 10x over here, okay? And what I have to do in order to make that happen is I have to subtract that 2x. I don't want it on the right-hand side of the equation, so I'm going to get it out of there. I'm going to evict it by subtracting it. But if I if I subtract the 2x on the right-hand side of the equation, i got to do it also on the left-hand side. Okay, so notice how I'm working. And the way I set my problem up is just the way I'm showing you here. Now I'm going to be adding down, okay? So 10x plus negative 2x is 8x minus 3. And now you can see my 2x is on the right-hand side went away. That's what I wanted. Okay, equals 25. So we're getting, we're getting pretty close to solving this equation. But i got to get rid of this negative 3 on the right-hand side of the equation. So I'm going to add a positive 3 to both sides. And I'm going to get 8x equals 28. Okay, and last but not least, to solve for x, I simply have to divide both sides of the equation by 8. x equals 28 over 8. Okay, I'm not going to spare you, or I'm going to spare you the, um, the gory details of reducing this fraction. When you're left with a fraction answer in um, your work, you do want to reduce it. Um, you know, maybe check with your teacher if they want it in a mixed number. Don't, I wouldn't just automatically turn it into a decimal. And by the way, when you're working with fractions, um, be careful by turning, converting fractions into decimal. That's another thing that gets students into problems. But listen, hopefully this video helps you out. And I want to leave you with a little uh, piece of important information. Tabletclass.com, please check us out. We have a 30-day free trial. Clear and understandable math is what we're knowing. Uh, what people know us about, students across the country love us. Why? Because we explain math in a way that uh, real life students actually get. Okay, if those of you who uh, have iPods, um, Xboxes, PSPs, you name it, you know, you're, you're busy, athletics, you know, that kind of thing. You know, um, you know all of us are not, uh, you know, in calculus AP in the ninth grade. So we understand that and we have ways to help you uh, get along. And by the way, even if you are pretty good in math, we, we can show you some cutting edge advices to make the most of it. But anyways, tabletclass.com, we offer a 30 day free trial, check us out. And if you don't mind, leave us some comments for this video. All right, keep working hard and good luck to yourself.